Hello friends. Now we are going to solve exercise 5.2. Let us solve this quickly. First question. Find the slope and y-intercept of the lines given below. You can refer your book there. Four sub questions are there. And you can see that the first question has come for one mark in March 12 exam. Again one mark for March 15 exam. Very simple problem. They are already given the equations in the form of y is equal to mx plus c and you have to find out what m and what c is or you have to write down what is the slope and what is the y-intercept. The first I am going to solve on the first one they are given the y is equal to 3x minus 5 and what they are asked find the slope and y-intercept if y is equal to 3x minus 5 then m slope is 3 and y-intercept is minus 5. Similarly, you can solve second one y is equal to 2 by 3x plus 4 m is equal to 2 by 3 and y intercept is 4. Third one is y is equal to minus 2 plus 3. This appeared in March 15 exam for one mark. Slope is minus 2 and y intercept is 3. The next one is y is equal to minus 3x minus 5. Slope is minus 3 and y intercept is minus 5. Second example, write the equation of line if m and c are given. That means they will give m and c and you have to just write the equation in this form. Okay, very simple, no need to solve here. Third one, write the equation of the line in slope intercept form. Now remember, I told you before that every time they will not say that write the equation in this form y is equal to mx plus c. They will simply say that write, write the equation or rewrite the equation in the slope intercept form. And you should know what is slope intercept form. This SI is slope and y intercept is nothing but y is equal to mx plus c. Now let us solve the first one in that 2y minus 3x plus 5. 2y minus 3x plus 5 equal to 0. These equations or these kind of equations they are given and they are asked to write in a slope intercept form that is y is equal to mx plus c. So let us write that 2y is equal to 3x minus 5 and hence y is equal to 3 by 2 x minus 5 by 2. So this is in a slope intercept form whereas 3 by 2 is the slope and minus 5 by 2 is a y intercept. So similarly you can solve the rest of three examples in main example number 3. So please pause your video and solve all of them. The fourth example is if 4 minus 3 if 4 minus 3 is a point on the line 5x plus 8y 5x plus 8y equal to c of course what is asked find c i told you that if this point is lying on this line then this point must satisfy this equation what do you mean by that if you replace x and y by these two values x and y only c is unknown and you can easily find a c. Let us quickly solve this. Let us replace x and y. So find 4 20 y by minus 3 that is 24 equal to c. So c is equal to minus 4 in this case. Let us solve next one. If minus 2 minus 3 is a point on line 2y is equal to mx plus 5 find m exactly similar example to this just substitute the values of x and y and you will get the answer so here we finish exercise 5.2 now exercise 5.2 was very easy it was just a substitution of formula and mainly based on the slope intercept form okay so you have to practice all these examples because uh, one of these examples will, will definitely come in your exam. Just find out 
uh, slope and y intercept this example can come for the one mark or the last two examples where the equation is given one point is given in equation one variable is there and you have to find that variable now that example can was appeared the fourth example was appeared in october 14 paper for two marks that means equation of the line will be given one point will be given which lies on that line and you have to find out the missing value that is a variable now this is important two marks very very simple example don't lose these two marks and this one mark okay sometimes you may be given uh, equation in some different form and you have to rewrite the equation in the slope intercept form so don't just uh, buy out the formulas but by the name of the form also that is the slope intercept then the slope point two points and intercept forms double intercept forms okay so here we finish exercise 5.2 it was very easy and i think it finished within 5 minutes but practice solve all the examples thank you let us solve now 5.3 